in your calculation. The sign is for subtraction. I'm going to stop right there. I want you to have a little think of any other words that you could think of for subtraction. <laughs>
Well, if I look at my 12, I know that it's a 10 and a 2. So to make this easier, I'm now going to say, well, first of all, I'll take away the 10. Counting in my 10s, I know that 23, take away 10, will take me back down to 13. It's the 10s changing, but not the units. And then I can take away my 2. 1, 2. So my answer is 11. Should we try one more of those together? OK, guys, let's try another one. 33 take away 16. Now, I've got my 33. Take away 16. If I was to keep jumping back in ones till I've jumped back 16, I might be here a long time. I'm going to do my partitioning method. And I'm going to split my 16 into the 10 and the 6. Now I can jump back 10. So 33 take away 10. One jump of 10 will take me to my 23. Then I need to take away the 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. I've landed on 17. I want you to have a go at that. Maybe you can practice these ones. 35 take away 15. Have a go at that one and maybe then you can have a go at another one that you can make. Guys, we're back with our next activity, moving along, building up different ways to do our subtraction. As we talked about before, we could do jumps rather than taking away one at a time. So I have 35, this time though it's take away 21. I know that 21 is made with a 20 and a 1. 20 is made with two 10s, Does that matter? Yeah. And therefore I can do two jumps of 10. So I'm on 35, 25, 15. There's my 10. 10, 20, so now I just need to get rid of my 1. 14. OK, another way that we can do this calculation is to use the column method. And it is what it says on the tin. It's in a column. So we have to make sure that we line everything up. We're going to line up under 10s and under units. So I have 35... And then it's taking away 21. So making sure everything is lined up in the columns in the correct orders. Now I am going to take away. And when I take away, I start from the top and always go down. Remember, we always go from the top down when we are taking away. So we start with the unit. 5 take away 1 is 4, making sure it's in the unit column. And then we have 3 tens take away 2 tens is 1 ten. So my answer is 14. Should we try another one? Lining up my tens and my unit. So this time I have 49 and I am going to take away... 35. Remember, I'm going top to the bottom. 9 take away 5 is 4. And 4 tens take away 3 tens is 1. So, oh, I've got 14 again. What I would like you to do is take the number 67. And then take away 33. Remember, top downwards, have a go. OK, let me show you this one again. 47 take away 38. Top down. 7 take away 8. Bit of a hard one, that. So 
let's do some exchanging 47 i'm going to make it 10 20 30 40 and 7 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 Right, let's exchange the 110 and move it over into the units. Let's change it into units. 4, 6, 8, 10. So it's still now. So what is my... I have not got four tens. I now have three tens. I don't just have seven. I have 17. Now I can do my calculation. 17 take away 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and I'm left with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and then I've got 3 take away 3, oh, I've got nothing, sometimes we are tempted to write I have got 0, but to be honest with you guys, we don't write 9 like that when we write 9 in our books. We just write 9. So I would probably leave it like that. I'd like you to have a go at this activity. I want you to perhaps, you could ask somebody in your house, say, can you give me a two-digit number? Can you give me a two-digit number? Or you might want to practice these at home. 49 take away... 33, 52, take away 35, and one more, 68, take away 59. Have a go, let me know. Everybody. I hope you found that useful on how to do subtraction and um, those are the methods that we use at Elms Bank High School and you can choose any which suits you and that you find that's easier. Have a go though and then if you want to send any video clips, any work that you've done, if you want to amaze and wow us like you do all the time and earn lots of merits, send them then to our link at the YouTube Elms Bank. See you later guys!